Coming to this university has given me a bunch of experiences. I am a simple person. I like simple things, so the things that intrigue me are the simple ones. My first experience at this university was the comfort it gave me. I am a student who comes from a very small community. I did homeschool, so that means I was in a very small class. My first experience at real school was a huge high school, and I was lost. When I came to university, I felt this is ed epitome of education. I need to ace it. I need to do well. I need to be at the top of school. So before I knew it, my first degree actually was an online degree. So when I thought I needed an on-campus university, yet I couldn't travel out of the country, I still needed to find a university here. So I checked into Cavendish University and it was what I was looking for after a long time. I get to experience the cultures, disciplines, lives of people from nine different, nine different nations and that was thrilling. Then my lecturers, the first, the first thing my lecturer did when he came to class was give us his contact, his full names and his email. So our interaction with the lecturers was up close, very up close. We can talk to them, we can call them, we can email them. And so that made me, you know, very close. In the long run, I have realized that that relationship becomes so personal, so parent, child kind like that it leaves no room for a lecturer for example to abuse me in any way then i also realized that this environment i mean puts me at a connection with people from over nine nations so our kind of discussions are diverse they're not exactly only the things we study in class they're as diverse as where we come from the kind of food we eat what we like to do um, who are our ancestors, and so the, my class conversations are quite interesting. Um, my course is interesting, but the life in my class is as well interesting. And the other final thing that quite gives me a great experience is that at this university, while I decided to study, I could ask a fellow friend to come to this university and I get a school fees discount. Now for all the students that probably pay their fees or you're bigger like me, so you want to take responsibility for education sometimes, that's a, a big financial burden lift. So I want to tell all the other students, if you're looking out for a university that is tailor-made for you, that's very small, small enough for you, that's comfortable for you, that's serene, that is conducive for you to study, success begins at Cavendish University. Technology to me, it has been a long life uh, passion and I really love to see myself being a computer scientist. However, to some level, uh, it seemed to be a long-term goal. However, when I joined Cavendish University, uh, given the facilities that I found, uh, it seemed to be a short term instead. Uh, the internet uh, available to us, uh, we use it basically uh, to make reasonable research for both our academic excellency and to also research on our career aspirations. It is then still uh, that with these resources and the adequate guidance that we've been provided to, uh, that I was able to come up with an idea um, was a mobile application. This came after when I realized that uh, a few students in my university were finding challenges, losing their properties, one and here, where, here and, where, and there, and they could not relocate where they were. So I thought, and I said, like, uh, let me come up with an idea an ITC solution whereby you students can relocate or they can reunite with their property. Um, and the app facilitates uh, for students to announce you know, what they've lost and also for those that have picked their property to get back to them when they get them. Um, when I would develop this app and when I presented it before the administration, um, I, did not, uh, I didn't imagine how far it could take me. It is not until when I got an invitation from National TV to present or feature my application. So to me, it was really a delightful moment, and that's when I saw as if my dreams are now coming true in Cavendish. And that's why now I believe that really success begins in Cavendish. I also, of recent, in Cavendish University, I contested for the post of Guild President. And I was really guided. 
I was really uh, treated well by the administration and the guild, and really the experience was just good. So that's when I also got ideas, uh, working on two projects now, which I'm, I'm currently working on. Uh, that is working on the e-voting system. Uh, briefly, the e-voting system is going to be an application that shall enable us students uh, to, to carry out our voting online in the comfort of our homes, hostels, and ETC. So that is just to simplify the process and not make it expensive and a bit exaggerated. Uh, secondly, it is the, it's the online results. Yeah, particularly currently the university, when they will release results, they put the results on the notice boards and we are required uh, or obliged to come and visit those who are to read the notices so that we can get to know what we performed, how we performed. Uh, but now uh, the solution I'm coming up with is when we can access these results online using our mobile phones or the devices that can access the internet. As you grow into yourself, the vision of your future becomes very clear. It is achieved through higher learning because it makes it more transformative, it makes it more objective, and it makes it more relevant. So the level of education is its own ability to transform, which I believe Cavendish University encompasses in a nutshell. I am excited and humbled for the opportunity to talk about my university. It is talent nurturing, yeah? Uh, this is through value addition. For instance, in my course, uh, journalism and communication, I am studying what I'm doing, and before I didn't have the greatest knowledge about it, I just had the talent. But uh, I've, I've gotten to learn a lot more as I go this semester alone. My personal journey starts in 2013, my, uh, working on TV. I was working with Urban TV and a vision group. I started to work there, but not with the knowledge of media. It was basically talent, as I mentioned earlier. And I was very clueless, but somehow I made it work for a year. But um, I believe that learning and talent are very different from each other because someone can have the talent, thrive in the industry without needing the knowledge, and someone could study and still thrive without needing the talent. However, when put together, the results are inexhaustible. So I am personally excited to be on board because of the limitless possibilities that are going to come with my very fast, very fast high degree that I want to get here. In Apple, I researched about Cavendish. I sent a message on Facebook. Of course, I didn't expect anyone to respond to me because our websites are not the most reliable, but under five minutes, a gentleman called Rogers responded to me, he walked me through the requirements, he walked me through my course, uh, scholarships that are offered here, and he went ahead to send me an email with an application form because I was a bit too far from the university. So I commend Cavendish University for their accessibility and they are student-oriented, and they don't just say that, they actually are student-oriented. So for what I've learned, I've learned to be a better communicator, I've learned to be a critical thinker, I've learned to respect the art a lot more, I've learned to be excited to see how the media is impacting my society. And I hope that at the end of my course, I will be in an even better position to do a lot more than I'm already doing. I hope to get only the best Cavendish has to offer. At the moment, when I was thinking of life as a process of conscious evolution, at the time when I was discovering this new 
person in me who was passionate about making a difference and being who really I am, this is a time when I realized uh, I needed knowledge as a tool to bring about the change that I dreamt of. At this moment, I was believing in what Jose Nelson Mandela said, education is the only way to transform a world. And I realized I needed this tool to bring about this change that I'm talking about. At Cavendish is when I got this weird idea of bringing a mentoring program from Australia, the Australian Indigenous Mentoring Experience, where I I believe it's upon us, university students, which is the most unutilized human resource in the whole world, to make a difference or to put a change to the way we want the world to work in the future. Because I believe the world works the way it works today because a certain group of human beings set it to work that way. We could be the ones to make this change. This is a kind of platform that provides um, students with an opportunity to grow into not only academic growth, but as human beings as a whole, to have an ability or an opportunity to contribute to the way the world is going to work. It's a program between university and high school, and now we have trained so far 40 university students. Among these 40 university students, we already have a student who has an opportunity to go to Australia in February to attend the festival of mentoring where they will have an opportunity to interact with over 200 students from the U.S. and all over the world who will be taking part of the training. In this program, we have not only provided an opportunity for the students to have a, a wider social awareness and the exposure to a global cooperation like AIM or a global program that equips them with uh, human skills and social skills and an opportunity to contribute to their own community. We have so far had 120 kids go through this program, kids from disadvantaged communities. These are kids in high school whose dreams had been shattered, who are given a shot at dreaming again. All this is made possible because Cavendish provides a platform for programs like AIM to exist. I made the choice to come to Cavendish University because a friend referred me here. And this was because of the affordable tuition, the state-of-the-art lecture halls they have, the serene study environment. And I must say, I have never had cause to regret this choice. The diversity of nationalities in Cavendish has made learning even more fun. Cavendish is indeed a land of opportunity for me because this is what I've enjoyed at Cavendish. Recently, I've been privileged to represent the university in a global student entrepreneurship com competition held in Lagos. And my team came top six out of over 76 universities from 15 different countries. And this has made me and my, my friends a co-owner of an energy company, which we hope to continue even after graduation. And this wouldn't have been possible without Cavendish University, and I'm grateful for that opportunity. Staying here as an international student has been even more secure because Cavendish University takes up uh, processing of student pass for international students very seriously. And this has gained them applause even from my own very high commission, the Nigerian High Commission. And their process has been recommended to other universities to help mitigate the fraud surrounding obtaining student pass for international students. I stand here as a living testimony of the opportunities that one stands to gain from Cavendish University. Success indeed begins at Cavendish University. Thank you very much.
having pursued my first degree in industrial and organizational psychology, I wanted to do a master's in employment law or labor law. I noticed that the program required me to have two bachelors, one in human resource and another in law. At the moment I had started working and needed a university that would fit into my schedule. Luckily enough, I landed on Cavendish's weekend law program with this very experienced staff, 90% of which are alumni of prestigious international law schools. Any law student would be in good hands. Our moot court, the only one of its kind, speaks for itself. Mooting is composed at Cavendish University and happens every semester. Not only does it contribute to one's final mark, but also imparts us with the needed court skills. The newly introduced School of Working Adults program would favor even the busiest person. It allows them to select how many course units they do in a semester, which gives them flexibility between work and studying. Cavendish University Faculty of Law is fully accredited by the National Council for Education and I would gladly invite anyone to join.